Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Marcia Ward. If you're new here today, I'm going to be filming a get ready with me. I'm going to be showing you guys how to get this look. Sharing with you guys my outfit, my makeup look, my perfume, my shoes, my bag, the whole shebang. So to get this finished look and if you're interested in watching it, stay tuned. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate it so much when you guys support me. It means the world to me. Hit the like button and don't forget to leave a comment down below. But to get this finished look, keep on watching. She just let me know. But it's sure no fear. It ain't safe from here. But she still gonna hold on. It ain't safe from here. But she doesn't. Happy New Year. I know I probably said that in my last vlog. But Happy New Year. I hope you guys are having a great year so far, 2021. Yeah. Hopefully it'll be better than 2020. Right, so I'm going to use the Maybelline Master Prime. So yeah, I'm, uh, I'm going to dinner tonight. I keep looking at the viewfinder because I got a new viewfinder from Amazon. Um, Y'all know I film on the Sony a7 II and it does not have a flip out screen and I'm not trying to pay um, more money for like the ZV-1 even though it's cool but I like the, I like the Sony a7 II better because it has, it has the capability of having an interchangeable lens. So yeah, I could change my lenses when I want and other stuff. But I got a viewfinder that attaches onto the top of the camera so I could finally see myself while I'm filming myself. <laughs> yes, I'm so excited. It just makes life so much easier when I'm filming for you guys. Bestie, um, we're going to Bonefish Grill tonight. I haven't been there in a minute, but I just remember that they had the Bang Bang Shrimp. <laughs> and oh, their creme brulee is so good, y'all. If y'all do eat creme brulee, their creme brulee is good. I haven't had their salmon yet, but um, I might try it tonight. So I'm just using Pore Professional. I don't know if you guys can see because it's kind of bright, but there we go. Pore Professional because y'all know my pores need to look like I have no pores when I do my makeup. How was you guys New Year's? I didn't do really anything big, you know, just stayed in, played it safe with my loved ones. Don't mind my lashes, you guys. I'm getting a fill tomorrow. This is Urban Decay Quick Fix Primer. Fancy Beauty Foundation and Luminous Silk. Y'all know I always mix these two together because they come out with the perfect, well, they create the perfect foundation color for my complexion. You guys, I really miss traveling so much, like so much, but I know it's best, you know, to stay in and play it safe. Um, I know from seeing it at work because, you know, it's, it's, it's been a lot. Mm. I almost forgot to use my, that's, see, this is how long it's been since 
<laughs> That's how long it's been since I've done a get ready with me. I was about to use my sponge instead of my fancy brush. Girl. Mm. So yeah, I got a lot more planned for my channel for you guys. I know it's been a while since I've done a get ready with me. Um, <clears throat> I just kind of took some time off to spend time with family and just focus on, you know, just me time for myself. <clears throat> Cause work is stressful enough as it is. So like when I'm off, the nights that I am off, I just like to dedicate time to just myself. Just having that time for yourself is so healthy. And I think everybody needs that. But yeah, Christmas and New Year's felt so weird without like, just like without like going out or without being around extended family and friends. You know, everything was just through FaceTime this year and it just felt so weird. But I'm looking forward to, you know, when it is time, when it is safe enough to, you know, be outside and to visit family. I'm just going in with the Sephora concealer. Sorry, my nose is running. I am not sick, but my nose keeps running. But anyway. It'll be a quick get ready with me, cause I put that, um, I don't know if you guys can see, yeah, but that shoe shelf in the back, I put that together. And then I installed um, some like recess, not really recessed in the ceiling, but little handheld lights that um, are gonna be pointing on me when I like stand in front of my mirror and take my pictures. Yeah, I just figured I'd get on camera and since I am going out to dinner tonight, I might as well just film a little get ready with me for you guys because it's been a while well, my hair has been growing um i am gonna put in some clip-ins tonight i'm gonna do this really cute like swoop bang hairstyle behind the ears like a little curl to it so yeah hopefully that comes out nice what have you guys been up to what's new what's tea tell me <clears throat> that sounded corny <laughs> I never really have anything to talk about on here. I feel like I'm so boring and I'm so reserved and I'm so quiet, but this is a way for me to open up to you guys and have you guys open up to me. So yeah, tell me in the comments below what you guys want me to talk about in my next video. 2020 for me made me appreciate even more um, the life that I live the blessings that I have, my job, a roof over my head, food on the table, clothes on my back, my family, you know, like all that stuff, um, no one should ever take for granted because COVID has definitely taught us that tomorrow is not promised. So you just gotta live in the moment. You got to live your life and take leaps of faith because you never know you just never know love contouring with these sticks the 
But yeah, I mean, 2020 was definitely an eye opener for everybody. Um, but I know for 2021, I definitely pray that it will be a lot smoother. Um, and I definitely pray for more health, wealth, and success for everybody, not just myself. Because I'm always thinking about you guys. And just as a nurse, um, you know, I my patients come first before anything. And yeah, it's... It shows that I have a lot of compassion because I do. I'm just gonna blend this contour out. Have y'all seen that movie Tenet? Yeah, okay, so the first time I watched it, I was able to stay up until, <clears throat> I wanna say like the end of the third portion of it but then it took me like two times to really watch it and pay attention like Tenet reminded me <clears throat> Tenet reminded me of like Inception like to watch the movie Tenet if you guys haven't seen it already it's amazing but you really have to pay attention to every single detail of every single scene in the movie. Like, every scene is like another layer of the storyline. And it all comes back around to the beginning. Like, it, it's crazy. Y'all just gotta, y'all gotta watch Tenet. That's definitely a movie that y'all gotta see. So another movie y'all gotta see is Greenland with Gerard Butler. Oh my gosh, that movie was so good. So epic. Definitely a must watch. So, on your free time, watch Tenet and watch Greenland. So good. Oh my gosh. The best Pixar movie I've seen, hands down, has been Soul. Like, Soul really, like, grabbed my heart. It made me feel like, okay, again, like, the Pixar movie Soul was so inspiring. And Pixar definitely has a way of telling a story where at the end of every Pixar movie, there's this powerful message. It's like, so powerful. And it's something that you're gonna take with you for the rest of your life. Like, I think that's what makes a great film. A film that takes you through all sorts of emotions and then gives you a powerful message at the end of the film. Like, that's what makes a great film. So, Soul by Pixar, y'all gotta watch that too. Like, where you at? My girl, I'm coming. I had to film. <laughs> yeah, this year, I definitely want to take a trip out the country. I definitely want to go to Paris or Dubai. Actually, no. Um, I've always wanted Paris. I've always wanted to go to Paris first. Like, I always wanted that to be the first city that I touch down in um, when I, like, the first time I go to Europe. I, I want to go to Paris first. Mm. I'm going to try my best to make that happen. Mm. Let's see. Gotta, you gotta be safe and you gotta take the necessary precautions like when you guys are traveling currently take the necessary precautions limit touching surfaces you know stay out of crowds 
wash your hands frequently. I mean, you already know the deal. Y'all don't need me to tell tell you that, even though I'm a nurse and I'm supposed to educate you guys on it. But yeah. Um, have any of you guys gotten the COVID vaccine? Let me know in the comments down below. Um, I like hearing uh, how people's bodies are responding to it. Because <clears throat> I know everyone's body is going to respond to it differently. So, yeah, let me know about that. Um, I'm definitely interested to hear people's experience with the vaccine. What did y'all think of um, the finale of Ghost Book 2? I can't believe they filmed the last season of Keeping Up With The Kardashians already. I saw it on um, Kim Kardashian's story. That's it. 14 years, 20 seasons of that show. And y'all know, that is my favorite show. Like, I don't care what nobody says. Like, that's my favorite show. And I've been watching it for years. Like, it's just so entertaining and I just, I love the Kardashians. Hence, I'm wearing Kim Brand skins. <laughs> I'm just over the, you know, dewy look. Like, I feel like matte, a matte makeup look makes your face look very well put together. This airbrush flawless finish by Charlotte Tilbury in the shade tan. It's so nice, y'all. It just it just makes it just brings the look together. Like that's the last thing I put on my face. Yeah, I love this powder by Charlotte Tilbury. It just brings everything together. It just brings the whole thing together. And it just evens out, you know, your skin. Effortlessly flawless. Oh, I need some new lip products. So I got the Dior. It's the Dior Lip Glow Cover Reviver Balm. I love this packaging too. Isn't this so pretty? That's good. I just want something subtle, like a little bit of brown. In the crease. Well, it's nice to go out for once because sometimes on the nights that I'm off, I'm like, uh, I kind of want to get out of the house even though I'm a homebody. But yeah, it's just nice to go out just for a little bit. Just for a little bit. Yeah, I'm just going in with this color right here. And I'm just going to put that in the inner corners a little bit. I have that little pop. And that's it. I'm gonna throw on some lip gloss and then we'll do fragrance. Um, I'll show you guys my outfit, my bag, my shoes, and oh yeah, my hair. Yeah. Got a new Charlotte Tilbury pencil, lip cheat reshape and resize lip liner in the shade Crazy in Love. Prime my lips with the Dior lip glow first. Oh, I got some new lipsticks from my coworker. So she got me um, milk lipstick in the shade cream. Oh, so pretty. And then she got me another milk lipstick by Milk Makeup in the shade Hype. Hype, Hype. I'm just gonna line my lips with the 
Charlotte Tilbury pencil. Up, oh, I picked up the Fenty Beauty lip gloss too in the shade Glass Slipper. It's so pretty and it's so shiny too. And it's not that sticky gloss, it just goes on like super smooth. Uh, I love it. So I'm gonna put that on on top. Yeah, I'm gonna go in with Cream by Milk Makeup. Oh, this is so good. You guys, this is the perfect shade of pink. Oh my gosh, and it goes on so smooth. Y'all. Milk makeup? Y'all need to sponsor me. <laughs> Cause your lipstick, yeah. It's gonna be in my makeup routine for sure. So the last thing for the lips, going to go in with the Fenty Beauty Gloss. Just for a little bit of gloss. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. All right, let's hit the Urban Decay D-Stick Spray and call it a day, even though it's nighttime. I'm hungry. I don't know what I'm gonna get to eat tonight, but yeah, it's gonna be good. Whew. All right. Done. Oh, it's windy outside. Something appropriate for the weather. <laughs> okay. The fragrance that I picked out for tonight is Decadence by Marc Jacobs. This is the fragrance that my man got me for Christmas. Um, I did an unboxing of this in my previous vlog. So if you want to see an unboxing of this, go back to my previous vlog and watch that. Um, I also showed you guys what else I got for Christmas, and this is one of the things. So it is so pretty. Oof, and it smells so good. So this is my perfume for tonight, and I'll show you guys my outfit. Hey guys, I just wanted to show you my outfit for tonight. Um, my shoes are Stuart Weitzman. My jeans are from Fashion Nova. This blazer is from H&M. The corset is from House of CB, and my bag is Bottega.